In 1.21, there are four new potions which I mentioned, but I didn't really give them in great detail. We have the Wind Charge Potion, which causes mobs to explode in a Wind Charged effect if they die. So if I kill this creeper, once it dies and despawns, it will explode into a magnificent Wind Charge. Yeah. We have the Oozing Potion, which we already know is fairly problematic. <laughs> Infested, which spawns silverfish upon death. And we also have the weaving effect. Now the weaving effect actually affects the player now. So we won't be able to test that unless we have cobwebs. So if we kill ourselves, what happens is when we respawn, we get little bits of cobwebs that spawn around the player's death. It also allows you to walk through cobwebs 25% more quickly. It almost looks like I have the speed effect, but I don't. It's just, I'm weaving around them. <laughs> like a spider. Unfortunately, the potency of the effect is unchanging. It doesn't spawn more cobwebs around you. It only spawns like five. <laughs> if I was to change that and give myself weaving infinity 255, this is what happens. Oh. Oh, look, it's all, <laughs> it's all dark. You might not be able to see this though on YouTube with their tendency to compress everything. Wait, wait for it. And we have a nice mathematical lattice of webs. Oh, this is painful. This is so painful on the eyes, oh my god. I can't believe I just splurged white blocks everywhere. Anyway, hi. The reason I made that intro is because I wanted to mask the true intent of this video. In the strictest of circumstances, this video could be removed. All right, I'm gonna show you this picture here. This is a creeper cape. It is an animation PNG style of the creeper cape that is probably going to be released on the 15th anniversary celebration of Minecraft. Minecraft came out in 2009, it is now 2024. 15 years, they're gonna be celebrating it with something. They're releasing this cape. So if I just run through this, it looks like the person is spinning. So the economy for capes has been ruined as of late. I don't talk about this sort of stuff a lot, but because everyone now has a cape, kind of defeats the point. Lava! But it definitely looks really good. I wouldn't mind having this. Unfortunately, this is a leak. You're not meant to know this. But if you search up 15th Anniversary Minecraft on YouTube, we have Waddles mentioning it. We have Echo Soldier, which has the cape on the thumbnail, so fine. There's also rumors of a new game coming out. So if you look at this tweet from SmokyStack underscore, if you click on this, there is a credits affiliation for internal new games. So this could be hinting at something, nothing fairly concrete though. But the most curious thing is that if you scroll just a little bit further down, the Minecraft 15 year anniversary map just got leaked. This video could be removed by Mojang. If there's any way for you to click on a video or to be enticed to click on a video, just title it, this video could be removed by Mojang or watch this video before Mojang deletes it. It's a video by It's Me, James, and <laughs> accordingly got leaked by a guy called Josh, who was apparently, according to him, the Josh, the famous Josh. I don't know who he's talking about. Do you guys know? A Josh. It's a pretty nice looking map though, if they're releasing it. If you didn't know, I actually made the 10 year anniversary map alongside Blockworks five years ago. As far as I know, I didn't get hit up to make this one, but just for the safety and integrity or lack thereof of my channel, I am not gonna show you this video. It's already been deleted once, so let's not make it happen again. Kind of feel bad for showing all this because obviously people want to go on it themselves. <clears throat> anyway, probably just gonna do this. Hold on. Grayscale, invert, rotate, flip. <laughs> Oh my god, banners. Oh my god, shop. Oh my god, funky lever. Chunk loaded. Shiny room. Oh my god, internet laboratory research facility thing. Oh my god, cakes. Fancy transition. <laughs> 